Charlize. Obviously, our set is all decked out here. We're a few days away from Christmas. Don't say that. I'm so panicked. I haven't done any of my shopping. Oh, but same. <laughs> oh, same, same. But I want to know, do you think you've been naughty or nice this year? Mm. We're going to find out. Oh, OK, actually. OK. Yes, we're going to find out on the Charlize Theron naughty or nice quiz. What's going to happen is I'm going to give you some scenarios, and you're going to tell me what you've done, what you have done or would have done in these scenarios, and we'll determine if you've been naughty or nice. <clears throat> Number one. In the past year, if a guy sent you a drink from across the restaurant, did you A, smile politely and give him a nod, B, lock eyes with him while you pour the entire drink on the floor, <laughs> or C, drink the whole thing in one sip and ask for another? But I think you know the answer to that. <laughs> C. Yeah, C. <laughs> OK. You know what? I, I honestly don't even think that's naughty. I think that's still the nicer option. I think so, too. I mean, Absolutely. That, you wanted me to drink it. It's rude to waste alcohol. Yes. Absolutely. I'd say you're very nice. OK, second scenario. This year, if you accidentally dented a car in a parking lot, did you A, leave a note with your contact information at Emily Blunt, or okay, <laughs> B, put $50 under the wipers, or C, set the car on fire? No, I, <laughs> A, all the way, yes. No, I believe in karma. You got to do the right thing. So yeah. you leave your contact information? Yeah. Wow. Yeah. I, I have several times. You have? Yes. You've hit many cars. I, not that many, <laughs> but in my, in my time, yes. No, you have to do that. That's just bad juju. I, I appreciate that. Bad juju. You're doing great so far. So far, it's, I would say very nice. Don't you agree? Very, very nice. Yeah. All right, last scenario. If you're naughty or nice, this year, if you found out one of your children was getting bullied at school, did you A, explain that bullying often comes from a place of insecurity, B, call the bully's parents, or C, show up to the bully's house with your Oscar, demand to see the kid, and scream, this <laughs> Monsters about to haunt your dreams. <laughs> Suck up. And that would be the one. <laughs> that, that would be the Don't one. Don't mess with my kids. <laughs> yeah. Don't mess with my kids. Absolutely. I feel that I'm gonna determine that you have been very nice, and Aww. I know you're always very nice. So thank you so much.